All right, yesterday we talked about all the great deals, discounts, and what's new at the State Fair. And today we're going to turn our attention to food, entertainment, and agriculture. Christy Chuckle joins us now. And yesterday, Christy, we talked about the Walenda, Nick Walenda being there, and that people will be able to ask him questions as he walks. Yes. Now so tell us how that did, Well, we've already put the request out on Twitter. Right. So we'd ideally mm -hmm. like people to tweet in their questions to Nick ahead of time if they can. Okay. The hashtag is ask Nick and Nick is spelled with just a K. There's no C. Oh, okay. So if you use that hashtag, we'll look at that question. We want to send those to him ahead of time. So as he's doing his walk, he can answer different questions that people have. Mm -hmm. But we also have text to screen and tweet to screen technology at our main stage. So people can tweet wow. and text things in during the show and we'll try to see if he can answer those as so, well. So like, you know, what's your favorite food on a stick? Would yes. be a good one? That would be a great one. Right. Yeah. <laughs> it's just how are you staying up there? Yes. That's That's an Another good one. Way too hard. <laughs> now, there's a lot of great acts this year. We've Absolutely. got Boston, you've got Kenny Rogers, and, and what, what are the other highlights you have? A couple of big, big country shows. You said Kenny Rogers, but we also have Lee Bryce and Chris Young coming, so that'll be the ah. first weekend. That's a double headline show. Great show. We also have Justin Moore there. Oh. Jason Derulo is coming Ooh, on Friday, this coming up Friday, so we're very excited about that as well. Happy Together Tour is back, and then Ooh, Nick well, Walenda okay. will be on that main stage. And you need to buy tickets yeah. for that Nick Walenda show, but they're only okay. $15 and that includes your fair admission. And they're still available. They are still available. All right, good to know. Reasonable. You can't talk stay fair without <laughs> talking these wonderful yeah, things that you brought with you, the cream puffs. Everybody has to have one, don't you think? I mean, you go to State Fair, you got to have a cream puff. You have to have a cream puff. Yeah. They've been around for 91 years, Ooh, so yeah. clearly they're delicious. They're working. Yes. <laughs> so, and we don't need to worry about the calories because you walk around so much during I the agree fair. With you, right? you can try all your favorite foods on a stick. We have more than 100 new foods this year, so hopefully you can try wow. some of those as well. But then you have to stop and absolutely get your cream puff. We have them at the original Cream Puff Pavilion. We also have two satellite locations at the park, so it's really easy to grab one. You have even no or, problem. Yes. So how do you go at the cream puff? You split it in half. I split it in half. Yeah, yeah. I do. I, I twist. <laughs> okay. yeah. Like the Oreo, right? It and I really like the needed. top. Yeah. yeah, the top's my favorite. Now, there's also a lot of food with bacon, of course. Yes. There's always a lot of bacon. <laughs> a lot of new things with bacon. We have a pizza this year that the crust is actually made out of oh, yeah, bacon right, weave. Right, yeah. Yes. So, hmm. no, you know, if you're trying to eat gluten-free, low-carb, it's there's got a lot of bacon. bacon things we're seeing yes. there. Of course, uh, beer always goes good with bacon. Beer goes very well with yeah. bacon. Anything yeah. new on the beer front? You know, we have a new area at our Budweiser Pavilion. It's where the patio was. They covered it this year, so that'll oh. be um, kind of our Goose Island getaway mm -hmm. there. Um, we have so many great beers at the fair. We have the Micro, which is in the Bank Mutual Amphitheater area, so we have lots of different micro brews on tap. And then, of course, we've got all your favorite Miller and Budweiser products mm -hmm. as well. So. A lot of fun. And, you know, the most important thing about the fair is the agriculture right. and the Absolutely. kids and the shows. Let's talk about that. Well, I was getting really excited today because all of the junior dairy kids are coming in. So they came in uh -huh. yesterday and today. We have the world's largest junior dairy show at the Wisconsin State Fair. So that starts on opening day tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. Case IH Coliseum. Those junior kids will be exhibiting both Thursday and Friday. So we really encourage you to come out. We also have a horse show tomorrow night. Oh, yeah, that's right. yeah, so there's... Lots of cattle there, lots of horses, and then throughout the run, you can check out all the animals in the barns and shows throughout the 11 days. You know what we learned about the junior kids today? What? They have the same curfew as John Milan. <laughs> <laughs> I did not know that. Yes, 11 o'clock. <laughs> young, young and old together. It's kind of like that. Well, Christy Chuckle, we appreciate Thank you being you so with much. us. Excellent Thank information. You. And Thank we know you. it's going to be a great week because the weather is so perfect. By the way, State Fair starts tomorrow. And we have a link to our interviews and more on Wisconsin Tonight's webpage if you'd like to check that out. So thank you again, Christy. And good luck. It's going to be a fun 11-day run. It will be indeed.